Guys, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. If you haven't heard, not sponsored by the way, please, this is not sponsored. I wish it was. But Popeyes has different flavored wings now. If you know Popeyes traditionally, you know that Popeyes usually is known for it's just regular fried chicken. Now they have flavored wings, almost like Buffalo Wild Wings or Wingstop. So there's five flavors. There's roasted garlic Parmesan, there's ghost pepper, there's honey barbecue, sweet and spicy, and then signature hot. I got all five. All right, let's open them up, shall we? I wanna see what they look like. We're starting with the sweet and spicy. This is what the sweet and spicy looks like. Yum. Oh, signature hot. What's happening here, man? Definitely just threw like five wings in there, pumped some sauce in the container, and then just shook it up. Presentation is a zero. I don't want that. Like that doesn't look really appetizing to me, but they do look crunchy. Ooh, and they've been sitting for a little bit. Okay, that was the roasted garlic Parmesan. That one is the most off-putting. Like, look at that. That is so disturbing. If you don't like the way like food looks, and that kind of turns you off from things, Popeyes, you done did it. You done did it with that one. You're lucky. You're lucky that I don't really care that much, because I just want to try the wing. Then this is the honey barbecue. Smells barbecue-y. And then ghost pepper. I think they separated this because they really didn't want to make a mistake on this. Oh, they're dry. They're dry. They're dry wings. So I guess that's why they came in that type of container. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Let's try them! So just strategizing here because now it's time for me to dig in. I think that I'm gonna leave the ghost pepper for last and we're gonna work our way from mild to spicy. I think the least, you know, spiciest is gonna be garlic parmesan. So we're gonna do that one first. Let me move everything out of the way. I think garlic parmesan is actually my favorite. It's like one of my favorite flavors to get. I usually always get that. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna get a ranch. A ranch. All right, so I'm gonna go for this one. Garlic parmesan. Look at the wing. It smells good. It kind of smells like Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm gonna try it without the blue cheese. I mean, the ranch. You can't go wrong with garlic parmesan. Wow, that's good. If you look into the chicken, actually, there's spice on it. Beware that if you do get, you know, the garlic parmesan thinking that it's not gonna be spicy, they use the actual spice seasoning that you would usually get if you were to just order. Like, you know how they have original and spicy fried chicken there? That's the spicy that they have on the garlic parmesan. I don't know if that's a mistake or if they do that with all the flavors, but yeah, that's what looks like it's happening here. And I love it. I actually really love it. It's not too overpowering. I give it a nine out of 10. I think it's great. This is solid for me. Nine out of 10, love it. Okay, next. Maybe doing honey barbecue would have made more sense as like a less spicier, you know? wing but whatever let's dig into it now these are the honey barbecue i'm not really a barbecue girl like that's not my go-to but i will eat some barbecue if i have to you know like i like barbecue food i just don't like the sauce look at the wing show you my wing like it's a makeup product like let me swatch this let's try it mm! very sweet a little bit tangy just a little it's reminding me of like the barbecue sauces that you have when you go to like water parks or theme parks or something, you usually get like chicken nuggets and french fries with barbecue sauce on the side. You know that type of barbecue sauce, but it's like really sweet and almost nostalgic. That's what this tastes like. I give this barbecue seven out of 10. Let's try it with the blue cheese. I mean the ranch, sorry, not blue cheese. I keep saying blue cheese. Mmm, 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 mmm. How could you go wrong? You can't. You can't go wrong. It looks like they also try to season this wing with the spicy. So I think all these wings are gonna have the spicy seasoning on it. I think I rated it too low with a seven, so I'm gonna bump it up to a, I'm gonna bump it up to an 8.7. Yeah, I'm gonna bump it up to an 8.7. I feel like that's more reasonable. Garlic Parmesan's a nine. It's definitely beating the barbecue because I'm not a barbecue person, like I said, when it comes to my wing sauces. Let's do next. We're gonna do sweet and spicy. Oof, look at it. Look at this one, very crispy. Can you see it? It's like glistening. Mmm. It's very sweet. Definitely more sweet than spicy. And if it's reminding me of any type of sauce, it's Applebee's. Let's try it with their buttermilk ranch. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> much better. It's much better with the buttermilk ranch. Like, I feel like this is a wing that needs buttermilk ranch. Like, I wouldn't really want to eat it on its own. It's fine if I have to. I'm gonna give them a 6.7 because it's very sweet. It's very sweet. I was expecting a little more tangy and a little more spicy. Definitely needs ranch. Definitely needs ranch, in my opinion. Next, we got the Signature Hot. Signature Hot! I'm actually really excited for this one because I love me some buffalo wings. It smells garlicky. I'm gonna go for this little wing right here. Crispy, still kind of crispy. We love that.
I have to do it without this one. For some reason, the sauce has like graininess to it. Oh wow, <clears throat> that one kind of kicked my butt a little bit. And it's not because it's spicy, it's because the sauce is a little bit grainy. Like it's not just liquidy sauce. It has like powder in it, like dry powder in the sauce. So it kind of went to the back of my throat because I didn't expect that. I'm gonna try to get some more sauce. This is not spicy at all. Signature hot. Come on! Not like I want it to like tear me up, but this is not hot. This is not hot. It is a very bready wing. Not a fan. I'm not really a fan of this one. I'm gonna try it with the ranch. I mean, it's good, but it's not the best. I give it an eight out of 10. It doesn't taste like buffalo. No, that's not the flavor it's giving. It's giving Cajun. That's what it is, it's not buffalo. I'm judging it thinking that it's gonna give me some buffalo texture. It's not buffalo, it's Cajun. Definitely Cajun, that's a Cajun-y spice. There we go, that's why it's a little bit grainy. I give it an eight. I feel like for what it is, it's cool. It's definitely different. I don't think I've had a wing like that, but that's also what's throwing me off because it's like, hmm, different. Do we like it or do we not? We're moving on. Next is the ghost pepper wing. Now this one, it doesn't look intimidating at all. Like, look at it. It just looks like cute little crunchy wunchy bears. Look at little crunchy wunchy bears. But uh, I shall beware, and I will beware. Ooh, I think I'm gonna go for a smaller one in case this tears me up. So I'm gonna go for maybe this one. I think this one's decent. Everything else looks extra crispy, so I feel like, you know, the ghost pepper seasoning, if it's embedded to the, I don't know if it's embedded in this chicken or not because the outside doesn't look like it's coated at all. Like what are they injecting the chicken with it or something? We're going in and we're gonna see how spicy this is. Let's do this. Uh, nothing's happening to me. Let's try it again. Bruh, wait, be for real right now. Is this ghost pepper or did they run out? This is not spicy. I was. I mean, I'm not complaining, but like, I thought it was gonna be extremely spicy. Is it a, like a light ghost pepper flavor or something? BFFR, that is not spicy. Just for the sake of it, I think I'm gonna go for another one because maybe it was just that wing. So I'm gonna go for a leg. This is very orange in there. Mm. It's just the color, it seems, because I'm seriously chilling. I thought ghost pepper was supposed to be like extreme. Could have been a challenge. Imagine, this is not a challenge, hon. I'd be so upset if I thought I was getting this as a challenge, you know, like, let's see if I can eat the hottest wing from Popeyes. Cause you know, like, Buffalo Wild Wings has one, probably Wingstop has one. I'm not too familiar cause Wingstop's not around me. But like, yeah, I'd be very disappointed if I thought that this was a challenge. I'd be like, ghost pepper where? It's not even spicier than the original spicy chicken that they have, you know? I feel like that's even spicier than this. It's just a chill little wing. I just thought it would do more, you know? I really need to know that if, if you ever tried this one, was it extremely spicy for you or am I bugging out? Because this is not spicy. At all. Okay, well guys, that was me trying all the new flavors at Popeyes. Overall, I'd say it started off with a bang and then it slowly declined. Because I feel like the wings that are less spicy are the ones that are more enjoyable. Not because it's not as spicy, just because they know how to make those better than they know how to make the spicy version. And I'm a spicy girl, so don't play with my spice. You know, like I wanna enjoy that. Ghost pepper! But yeah, I definitely need to know that if you ever tried the ghost pepper wings from Popeyes, are they spicy? Let me know what other foods you want me to try because I'm down. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Do all that good stuff. And I will be back with more videos.